So we are going on. Well, <coughs> uh, she put on a sports suit uh, and was about to lose her temper when her coach Ken finally showed up, finally appeared, finally showed up, showed up, appeared. You are late. <coughs> I apologize, Miss Cameron. I'm sorry, Miss Cameron. The alarm didn't ring. So, I'm having a difficult day today. I'm having a hard day today. Let's begin. Okay. They made a half an hour warming up, warm up, and got over to accomplishing some vigorous aerobics exercises. Aerobic exercises. She's got a body of a 20 year old one. Can note it, uh, can notice, can admit it mentally can admit it mentally in delight in delight that would be great that would be great to get her into bed <laughs> well she would get satisfied with the very opportunity to each morning come here to every morning come here be close to her and looking at her. People constantly asked him. People kept on, kept on asking, kept on asking him. What is she like, Laura Kemmer? And he unchangeably, and he unchangeably answered. And he would unchangeably answer. Well, the lady is what one needs also. <laughs> well, the lady is very good. Well, the lady is a, the lady. It's a proper. She's a proper lady. Of we can say she's a proper lady. Yeah. So, Laura would accomplish intensive exercises with no special efforts. However, her mind at that time will mind was preoccupied by absolutely different things. Was occupied with an absolutely different thing. When the workout, when the training session was finally over, Ken about to go said, mentioned, I'll run and see your performance in Good Morning America program. What? For a while, um, engaged with considering the upcoming appointment with the Japanese bankers, Lara had completely forgotten about her TV interview. See you tomorrow, Miss Cameron. Don't be late, Ken. So Laura took a shower, changed, and had breakfast alone. Oh, either we can say alone or in solitude. In her solitude on the terrace of her penthouse. Her breakfast consisted of a grapefruit, an oatmeal, and green tea. After that, she proceeded into her study, into her study, oh, office, into her office, into her study, and got in touch on the intercom with the secretary. <coughs> as for the phone calls, as for the phone calls, I'll be conducting them from the office. As for the phone talks, 
I'll be conducting them from the office. Laura warned. At 7 I have to be in ABC. At 7 I have to be in ABC. At ABC we can say, or well, since it's a television company, uh, A goes for Australia, America uh, Broadcasting Corporation. Okay. So, uh, take care that Max gets ready with the car. Take care that Marx uh, unparks the car or gets ready with the car. Gets ready with the car. The performance in Good Morning America program uh, was going on the very best way. The very best way. John London, who was the interviewer, oh, interviewing her, was as usual kind and friendly kind and friendly considerate and friendly kind and friendly good okay to be continued guys thank you for watching this it's all like qs on this music it's like it's nice